it was intended to be a journey of discovery, a return to the moon, where astronauts would walk on the lunar surface and return heroes. But for Apollo 13, what we discovered instead was that sometimes heroes work behind the scenes, performing calculations and using raw ingenuity to solve problems never encountered before. We had already visited the moon on the Apollo 11 and 12 missions. What had seemed impossible, leaving Earth and traveling a quarter million miles to the moon and back had been achieved and success was expected. But two days into the mission, as the crew traveled 200,000 miles from Earth, an oxygen tank on the command module exploded. Astronaut James Lovell reported. Okay, right, we've had a problem here. This is Houston, say again, please. All right, Houston, we've had a problem. Suddenly, landing on the moon was no longer the goal. Returning the crew home safely was the mission. Millions of people around the world collectively held their breath as NASA engineers and contractors came together to devise a solution. The command module's normal supply of electricity, light, and water was lost. With the command module badly damaged, the crew and ground controllers quickly came to the same conclusion, to use the Grumman-built lunar module as a lifeboat. Designed to support two men on the lunar surface for two days, the lunar module now had to support three men for four days. A new navigation scheme had to be devised to loop around the moon and bring the crew safely home. New procedures, from improvising a solution for removing carbon dioxide from the cabin to how and when to separate the modules from each other before re-entry, had to be devised. After nearly four days of around-the-clock work of hundreds of dedicated people on the ground, the crew safely splashed down in the South Pacific Ocean. What could have been a tragedy became a story of human ingenuity and determination. And it was the work of engineers, scientists, technicians, who made the safe return of the Apollo 13 crew possible. Integral to the effort were teams from Grumman and TRW, as well as men and women of the legendary aerospace companies now a part of Northrop Grumman. All of us at Northrop Grumman celebrate the amazing people that built the lunar module and contributed to Apollo 13's dramatic rescue. Not just because their accomplishment is our legacy, but because they set the standards of commitment, quality, and innovation that we live up to. And it is our story. Today, the human exploration teams of Northrop Grumman soar and explore thanks to the Grumman Lunar Module Team. Their accomplishment will never be forgotten. We will go back, and we will go beyond. <laughs>